So this is inside my heart. I didn't think it'd be like this. Do you remember? This is the suicide note. The men in black suits read it right after mom died. That's correct. Look at the next one. This... This is... When mom jumped in front of that car. That's right. Now the next. No. Don't run. I thought you made your mind up after you talked to the Phantom Thieves. Okay. I'll look. It's me complaining. Mom scolded me for bothering her. Yes. I knew it. It was me who killed Mom. I was a bad daughter. I weighed her down and she hated me for it. It's just like I remember. Are you sure? Huh? Remember everything. Don't avert your eyes. When did this happen? Just a little before Mom died. I whined about wanting to go on a family trip. But she scolded me and said no. Was that all she said? Mom said, I'm too busy right now. I need to finish my cognitive research as soon as possible. And what did you do? I threw a tantrum. Told her she thought her research was more important than I was. That's when she scolded me. What did she say afterwards? There was more. Ah. Uh, did she say... My research is almost over. Once it's finished, we can go wherever you like. I'm sorry I've left you alone for so long, Futaba. Please try to understand, though. This research is really important. I need to complete it. Even if it costs me my life. Did she hate you? She didn't? What? She smiled. Ah! My head! It hurts! Which is true! Your memories. Huh? It's calling me? The hell? We ain't doing shit to it! Huh? Futaba? You came into your cognitive world? How did you even get here? Mm-hmm. The person themselves coming into their own palace? If that happens... That's... You killed her! No! Why don't you say something? It's your fault! It's my fault. It's my fault that Mom... That's right! You killed me! Wait. Is that monster her mother? Futaba's desires and guilt must have distorted her cognition of her. The wish that her mother was alive again is mixed in as well. Along with those eerie jeers.
Could she be talking about cognitive science? You're going to die! There is no meaning to your life! No one needs you! Nobody cares about me. I should never have had Futaba. She was always such a bother. It seems you caused your mother a great deal of trouble, Futaba-chan. She must have had some kind of maternity neurosis. Hey, we're gonna be in deep shit if this keeps up! So, because she thinks she killed her mother, and because she thinks she deserves to die, Futaba gave birth to a palace where her mother wants her dead? Futaba-chan, look! There's no way that monster is your mother! It's just an illusion you created! B but She never abused you, did she? Boss told us! He said she did her best to raise you alone. Isn't this a false memory that's been imprinted upon you? A false memory? Ugh! You made your mother destroy all her research, Futaba Chan. She had worked so hard on it as well. She lost her mind, and it's all because of you. It's your fault! Um, I. It's her shadow! Futaba Sakura, remember! You're the reason she committed suicide. You were just getting in the way of her research. Why did you think it was suicide? Because of the note. Exactly. The men in black suits read her suicide note to you. And what was written on it? All of her complaints... about me. Yes. The shock and the pain led you to avert your eyes. But they kept reading it aloud in front of your relatives. Think hard. Was that suicide note real? Would the mother you loved so much truly have written that? Did she ever say such horrible things to you? No! She scolded me whenever I had tantrums, but she cared for me! Then what about the suicide note? A total lie! You were used. They forged her suicide note and laid the blame of her death upon you! They trampled all over your young heart! Get mad! Don't forgive those rotten adults! It's because I couldn't face myself, or Mom's death. Even then, why did they have to yell at me like that? <sighs> Utaba-chan? What denies you is an illusion. A curse put upon you by the Heartless. You knew from the very beginning. And yet, you cowered in fear. Oh, that's right. I knew, but I... It's all your fault! This time you'll be the one to die! Will you die as you were told? Who will you obey? Cursed words spat out by a seething illusion? Or the truth within your own soul? It's your fault! It's all your fault! I won't let those distorted lies deceive me anymore. And I won't be led astray by others' voices either. I'm going to trust my own eyes and my own heart to distinguish the truth from the lies. There's no way you're my mom! You're just a fake created by those horrid adults! 
Well, well, we'll be counting on you. This is my heart's world, right? Hacking into my distortion should be no problem for me. I won't let you! You goddamn brat! Now it's our turn! Here goes! I'm summoning our ultimate weapon to the battlefield! A ballista? Shoot it down with this, then beat the crap out of it! Ah, I get it now. Let's go! Time to fire? I mean, yes. Why? Why, why is that a question? Yes, just go! I can shoot it down. You want me to fire it? You want me I mean, honestly, it doesn't- it doesn't matter. Uh, on. Alright! So! Hey, good thing all of our health and SP recovered, huh? And our guns. Every everything is just back to, to pre-fight, huh? Yeah, kind of a uh, kind of amazing. Hey, just like with every other fight I have mentioned in this game, this this went completely differently. I mean, it, it, it looks the same. It's not much different, but let me just say, it is ten times more easier than how it was originally. Uh, let, let's just say we were attacking from afar. That's not true. Mom is gone. No matter how much I wish for her to be with me, it'll never come true. That's why I'll live in the real world, even if she's not there with me anymore. And I'm gonna live my life as free and happy as I can. For a child to survive on your cruel world, they need a concerned mother figure like me. Understand? Nah, you're a fake. My mom is so precious to me, and I still love her a ton, but you're not her! And I'll never live a life where everything gets decided by someone else! Lucky children will decide ever, but be punished! <laughs> So 
back to what I was saying. Yeah, the original was a little bit harder because it's more more like this, where you attack from afar, you deal with the onsl onslaught of a uh, uh, high, very high damage, and Futaba does not support you like how she is right right now by putting up a barrier and, and junk. So like y you know, it, it's very much appreciated. Also, you may have noticed that Futaba isn't uh, a fighter because she's she's a navigator. We have a navigator now. She, she can help us like she can be better support than Morgana that that's the that's the interesting thing I mean we still get hurt it's not it's not a guarantee I need to heal up Mona Cool, direct hit. Since we now, since we're now in this phase of the fight, I should probably go and uh, go all out, huh? I said go all out, but like really, I don't have a lot of skills. I also said I need to heal Mona up. Yeah, let's heal Mona up. Good thing you have Medea Rama. Not that I wanted you to have it, but hey, it's convenient. It works. All right, uh, let's slap a gorilla. Yeah, yeah, Cognitive Wakaba does not have any strengths or weaknesses, so, like, you're fine to use, like, all of your attacks. Just basically go all out when this, when you're fighting her. It's fine, it's not a challenge. For reasons that will become obvious. Uh... I can go for you. Cause you know you have the powerful skills, like like my Bufu Dine. You know, make make an ice tree. I guess I could talk more about like the old the uh the original fight in more detail. I thought there was gonna be more dialogue and stuff, which is why I haven't been saying anything. Uh, oh yeah, I could have put up Vault Guardian the entire time. That's why I have you, and I don't use it. Hilarious. But yeah, the original fight was a lot harder. A lot more attacking from the range, shooting shooting the cognitive walkabout down, and rinse and repeat. Like what we're doing right now. And then, you know, inflicting status conditions on every- Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, no kidding. It is bad to ignore. Do I do I have a skill? No. Okay. Who's next? Out of curiosity. On. Okay. I'm, I I briefly mentioned despair, um, before. But if you don't remember, if you don't remember me telling you, uh, TLDR, I have uh, I have like a basically a ticking time bomb on myself. I have. A certain amount of turns! Oh, thank god, I have a happy pop. I have a certain amount of turns before I, you know, die. And, like, me being the main character, I can't die. I also lose SP every turn, but that is not the important part. The important part is that I die. So here, have a lollipop. You'll be happy, right? So, like, if you ever, if you ever get inflicted with despair, yeah, yeah, deal with it. Like, fast. Or instant. I wonder if energy shower would have gotten rid of it. I should have checked that. Oh, it's fine. I I'll take dizziness and despair. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, what does rebelling do? Oh yeah, it increases crit chance. Well, I'm on the healing, so like I gotta heal. Mona should be the healer, but to be fair, Mona doesn't have a lot of good skills. <laughs> but you do have the stat healing, so like that that's fine. I guess I could No 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 no, don't guard. <laughs> Accidentally pressed the wrong button. Alright. Energy shower. But yeah, I could have just waited for Makoto's turn. Whoops. Hey, now I know for next time. It is a good thing I didn't like you know, get rid of it. It's like I knew there was a skill that we have that, that can uh negate despair. I just don't remember what it is. As long as it's not me, I don't care. Uh, let's do... You know what? Let's do a charge. Let's boost up our next physical attack. Or a physical skill. Let's do that. And then you... You can heal on. <laughs> On's not looking so hot, but it's fine. And then... Well, let's just hope you can aim. You did it! Alright, and then you slam. Alright, technical damage! Alright, technical damage! Alright, alright, alright. Um. Anyone here has a powerful. You, but it was only even more powerful if there was a baton pass. I missed because I forgot physical skills. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. I'm a dummy. All right. Um. It's fine. It's fine. Just, just go all out. Just go all out. We need our mages. We don't need any of our of our physical brutes. All oh, right, that was still active, huh? That was our one free uh physical counter. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'll just be on healing duty. Oh, uh, well, lucky. Oh, wait, no, I was gonna say, well, Lucky Punch do it, and then my, and my idiot self was like, wait, you idiot. Have we unlocked the next phase of the fight yet, or what? I feel like we've been on this phase for a little bit too long. Not gonna lie. I have guns. One of these should do a crit. Oh, it's ama I'm not amazed you were able to aim at all. No, oh, come on. I just healed off that damage. Oh, no. Fine. We're fine. We're fine. It's okay. I can just heal off the damage. I can just heal off the status. Why did I hit X? <laughs> Why did I hit X like an idiot? Wow, you're so wrong. Got her. We we got her back. We're friends. No, 
With them, even the impossible can be made possible. Lucky children who defy their parents must be punished. I mean, yeah. You want me to fire it, right? Sure. All right. I don't have guns. All right. Where, where is Deki Abra? Deki, Dekara, be with it. Oh, do we really need? Yeah, well, it's out this low, but like, it's still a lot. We're not doing a lot. It's fine, I blocked it. <laughs> With sheer willpower, I blocked it. Um... I can just... Just attack. J just attack. D don't worry about healing. I should probably worry about healing, but don't worry about healing. The famous last words, you know? How much is this gonna hurt? Alright, not that much. Um, spoke too soon. Wait. Yeah, I really spoke too soon. How we avoided all of that? Yeah, I got you. I'm the healer of this group, apparently. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have to waste this turn healing, but it's fine. Anyone else knows we're not doing as much damage as we should. We'll be taking Futaba now. Shut up. Shut up. No matter what you say to me, I will live! Gun! What a victory screen to land on, am I right? <laughs> Look at all these levels! Even Futaba gained a level! It's a step forward. Sweet. Who learns skills? Everyone learns skills. Ambient aid. Uh, increases in chances of inflicting ailments. Uh, fire break won't buy. Probably regret it later. Oh, you learned Akuna. That's actually super useful because it removes stat debuffs. Um, I can get rid of Rakukaja because I still have Vault Guardian on her and having that kind of redundant until I decided to get rid of it. Futaba! Damn, you're freaking incredible!
Whoa, what in the world? Ooh, it's totally skin tight. Another thing showed up? Mom? Huh? Futaba. Thank you for choosing to remember the real me. I'm sorry for being so selfish. Mom! Don't come over here. This isn't where you're supposed to be, is it? But I finally got to see you again! Are you being selfish again? Um, I... I love you, Mom! I love you too, Futaba. Now, you should get going. Right, Majid. Where are you going? Home. I know how to use the nav now. Huh. Oh, right. She left. That girl marches to the beat of her own drum, doesn't she? Like you're one to talk. But if we have her on our side. Wait, what about her treasure? Oh yeah, we almost forgot. It's empty? <laughs> What's going on? Wasn't it supposed to be here? Futaba herself was the treasure. And she's gone, so of course it's empty. Shoot. This is bad. What's the matter? Not only did the real person come into her own palace, she awakened to a persona while she was here. This place could collapse any second now. We've accomplished our mission if her palace is crumbling. We should hurry back to reality. That would be wise. still alive? I thought I was gonna die and... Uh, hey! Will you let go already? <laughs> <gasps> Sorry! Not again. What was that sound? Hmm? What are you guys doing out here? Oh, um... Reminds me. Where's Futaba? What about Futaba? Oh, um... <sighs> yes! We came all this way, so how about we enjoy some coffee? Oh, that's a great idea! That's fine, but... I'm not thirsty, though. <clears throat> oh, I almost forgot! I have some business to take care of, so you guys go on ahead. Uh, okay, gotcha. Let's go see Futaba. Futaba? Can you hear me? Please say something! Please! 
Could this be our fault? Is it because we defeated her monstrous mother? No. That was nothing more than a cognitive being created in her mind. Destroying it wouldn't cause memory loss or put a physical burden on her. What should we do? Hey, don't you know a doctor? Oh well, yeah, I do know a doctor. You do? Can you contact them? A house call is gonna cost you, you know. How much will it be? That was a joke. So, um, how is her condition? Her pulse, breathing, temperature, and blood pressure are all normal. No ocular abnormalities either. I'm not sure why, but it seems this girl is in some kind of light stupor. Furthermore, she lacks muscle for her age. I doubt she has much stamina either. I see. The rebound from her awakening was too strong. There may have been too many abnormal circumstances. We simply cannot keep quiet about this. We should let Boss know. Wouldn't he figure out our identities? Still, we should tell him, shouldn't we? I mean, sure, as a responsible guy in this entire game, I guess we gotta tell him. Mm, I think that would be best. Letting him know is really the only option we have. I guess it can't be helped now. Just keep the circumstances that led up to this a secret, okay? Hey, Futaba? Hey! <sighs> oh dear. Uh, um... About Futaba... Hmm? Well, why do you guys look so down? Futaba-chan's condition. What, this? It happens every so often. Wait, what? Huh? She must have used up all her energy. It's like she ran out of batteries. I think it happens because she doesn't get enough exercise. What? She stays like this for a few days whenever this happens. I'll make sure she gets plenty of rest. Here, keep an eye on her. I'm gonna go close the store. Hard to describe how I feel right now. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty frustrated. I'm glad she's okay, but what are we gonna do about Majed? Uh. She's up! Mm, Majed. Uh. Uh. Tired. Gonna sleep for a bit. She fell asleep again? Futaba-chan! For a bit? How much is she planning on sleeping? We probably shouldn't wake her up, either. What to do? It's too late for us to find another hacker. All we can do is wait for her to wake up. The chief is with her. I'm sure everything will be okay. We just gotta wait for Futaba to wake up. Yeah. What? What a... What a strange way to end off a palace, am I right? Haha. <laughs> huh.